Welcome back, everybody. I am the Jimmer. This is Bunker Assaults. We're on episode 14. We have the N Acetyl P Benzo Quiet 9, I mean, by Slim Pickens. And uh, that's a mouthful of a name. I looked up the uh, the chemical that uh, that's the name for, and it's apparently, I think it's like when you uh, o overdose on, I think, like aspirin. Maybe Tylenol, I don't know, some kind of like one of those painkillers. It's the uh, chemical that's created in your liver that is uh, toxic and eventually can kill you. So don't don't take too much of uh, those those pain meds. It's bad. <laughs> but I don't know why it's named that. I'm not really sure. Maybe the you know even the the molecule itself didn't really look like that. So I'm not sure where the joke is if there is one there. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and unpause this just for a second. There we go. Get those shields out of the way. And full disclosure, I did make some modifications to this design. Uh, when it came in, it was on a... Uh, it was basically the, the bare metal parts you see weren't there. And it had like one stick of glass beams holding it like 15 uh, meters. Like maybe 10, 15 meters up in the air. So not really um, in the spirit of the rules, um, no, no physics abominations allowed, so. Um, and it also had some uh, ram turrets, which is basically just trying to get around the uh, no, no rams on spin blocks. So I uh, clipped those off, got rid of the glass tower, and uh, it does have this little like mine chute here at the bottom. Um, You'll, you'll be able to see it a little bit better once we get going, but uh, basically mines drop out and it poops out mines behind it. And so I, I gave it some uh, metal feet here just to lift it up um, off the air so it's not uh, blowing itself up all the time with the mines. And I think that is a, a fair compromise. I think, uh, I honestly think Slim Biggins made this purely just to uh, annoy me because he didn't like how I uh, had the aesthetic roots rules. In super supers, but uh, either way, I think it's an interesting design, and uh, we'll let it run um, with those. I think those modifications make it so it's not quite so cheaty. And um, yeah, that is the N Acetyl P Benzo Quinine. I mean, by Slim Pickens. Let's get this on pause and uh, see how it does. The uh, the biggest feature of this is obviously the insane amount of shield layering. I'm not sure how effective that's going to be. I mean, it'll probably be pretty effective against the um, later tanks, but the uh, Triceratops, I, I believe they have inertial fused um, explosive rounds. They have HE and flak, and I think they have uh, inertial fuse. So you see with that it's able to get through the shield. Yeah, you can see them detonating in the shields. Is it doing damage? Oh, a little bit, not a lot, but slowly wearing down. And the, uh, Amin, what are we gonna call this thing? Yeah, we'll call it the Amin. Um, does have some pretty good guns of its own. It's got this Triceratops down below 90%. Looks like it's gonna take it out fairly quickly. I do believe those are fixed guns, though, so they're not gonna be able to attack. The uh, Triceratops once they swoop around behind it. Oh, yeah, we'll take a look at the, uh, the uh, mine layer here. Oh, it looks like it's been damaged, but uh, you can see the uh, mines which uh, dropped out behind it. Not doing a whole lot of damage. Alright, here come the Crammer heads. Oh, yeah. So it's blocking the hash, but you can still see the um, heat particles are detonating against the shield and uh, doing damage. Still 97%, uh, 2 minutes in, almost 2 minutes in, that's pretty good. the 
tumble heads. Oh no, it's still that same that same rhino from the beginning. Missed. Here comes the second new. Oh yeah, it's gonna miss too. Is it gonna take up the Triceratops? No, I'm having a hard time landing against the uh, very narrow base. There you can see the mines coming out. Oh, they ran out of fuel. <laughs> See the cram starting to come in from the Doom Boss. Oh, there goes that new. Did it hit the tower? It doesn't look like it really did any damage. Over three minutes in, uh, just dropped below 80%. <laughs> the noobs, the noobs just could not hit it. Oh, that was a big explosion. That must have been a crammer head. Oh, and finally the noobs are uh, making their way in. Oh yeah, lots of noobs. Amin's still standing strong though. Oh, those noobs took each other out. Starting to lose some of that shielding. And here comes the HRA-5. This is going to be the real test. That thing is a beast. It looks like the, uh, the frag rounds are getting uh, fairly well scattered by the shields. Oh, there goes another nuke landing. Yeah, I totally blown out the the bottom of the tower, but it's still functional. Oh no, I'm not sure. It's like maybe the guns detonated. It dropped uh, pretty quickly there once it started to go. It's still a pretty good run, lasting almost five minutes. Congratulations, Slim Pickens! Another uh, really strong entry. Did really well in the Super Sloopers tournament and uh, doing well here. But that's it for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, uh, give me that thumbs up and we'll see you next time.